Madison, you lost to Simone Jock today, 6-2, 6-1, but that's really not indicative no. of how close this match was. Correct. It, it really was every almost every game. Well, I think six games went to deuce, and it's no ad, so you would go into that next point wins, you know, so that's crucial. And then um, a lot of the games were 40-30, so the score didn't reflect the match. Now, in the second set, you were down 2-love. You broke to get within 2-1, and then she blanked you in the next yeah. game to go up 3-1. That was a real turning point, wasn't it? Yeah, that, that was a turning point. I have a tendency to talk to myself, and I think in that, that game, that turning point was when I started uh, telling myself negative things. And I need to work on my mental toughness where I start pumping myself up in times like that. Pump, like, come on, let's get the next shot, instead of just getting mad at myself and yelling at myself. And I think that's why I, I'm mental. Overall, do you feel good about where your game is at, though? Yeah, I feel I got a lot better from last year, so come on out strong. <laughs> Simone, you won 6-2, 6-1 today over Madison McKay from yeah. Gregory High School, but it uh, was a little closer than the final score might have led us yeah. to believe. Um, yeah, this, I don't think the score really reflected how close the actual game scores was, um, but when it came down to the crucial points, you know, I felt like I pulled through and made that trademark of, I'm going to win this match. You struggled early on with your first serve. Uh, usually not a problem for you. It's usually not a problem, yeah, because when I won the toss, I chose to serve first. So when I caught myself like barely making my second serves, I was like, okay, Simone, don't go for the first serve. Hit your second serve, get it in, you know? Uh, you said coming into this match that you were a little bit nervous and had to give yourself a pep yeah. talk today. All day, I was like, you know, Simone, you're not nervous, you're not nervous. But when I actually, like, when I stepped into the court, I felt back the jitters in myself. And I'm like, yes, yeah, it's a little, a little uncomfortable for me, but I think I pulled through it towards the end. Ultimately, what what was the difference for you today? The difference, I honestly think I was mentally tough in her. Um, you know, I wanted it so bad to like validate like the hard work I put in this last summer. And you know, obviously, my last few years playing Lorel has been my every year like okay, gotta defeat your guard, defeat yourself. So it's Lorel Rodriguez. Yeah, Lorel well, Rodriguez. She graduated last year. Um, when I have Madison McKay, like this is that person you know I have to beat to play my MMC champion. Well, listen, congratulations to you, you, and best of luck the rest of the year. Thank you so much.